For the first few years of Cam Newton's career, it certainly seemed like the sky was the limit. Coming off of what he did at Auburn in his last season there, to winning Rookie of the Year, making a Pro Bowl, and then of course, winning an MVP and taking his team to the Super Bowl, albeit in a loss to the Denver Broncos. But it didn't go well for Cam Newton after that. He fell off hard. People started to figure out exactly the way to defend him. It didn't seem like his head or heart was in it at times. And the last few years have been kind of a nightmare, including last season where he wasn't even on a roster. But instead of acknowledging reality that people don't want him anymore because he's not a good quarterback and he doesn't want to take a backup role anywhere, he wants to be a starter, he thinks he can be a starter again, instead of acknowledging the reality that everyone else has acknowledged about Cam Newton and his career, Cam Newton is instead blaming it on something else completely. He's blaming it on how he looks, specifically his hairstyle, and even alludes to some racism being thrown in there. Because, of course, how could Cam Newton not try to play the race card, despite the fact that like the top five highest paid quarterbacks in the NFL right now are all black, despite the fact that the first three quarterbacks taken in the first four picks of the NFL draft were black, Cam Newton is trying to make some association with him being black and his hair hairstyle to why he's not on an NFL team. Cam Newton thinks his hairstyle and fashion sense have hindered his chances of being in the NFL. Free agent quarterback Cam Newton believes his dreadlocks have impacted his ability to be employed in the NFL. When CBS Sports' Josina Anderson asked on Tuesday if Newton feels his ability to get a job in the league has ever been impacted by, quote, his way of dressing and his hairstyle, the former Panther star answered affirmatively. It's been hindered, and I'm not changing, Newton said. But yeah, people have hinted towards to say like, Cam, we want you back to 2015 clean cut Cam. But that was a different me. Right now, where I'm at, it's about embracing who I am. Well, maybe when they're talking about 2015, Cam, they mean your MVP season, your 15-1 and one season, when you took your team to the Super Bowl. Maybe that's why they're referencing 2015, not necessarily the way your hair looks. Cam Newton, if you want to look as dumb as possible and you're putting up 50 touchdowns and 12 picks, if you're throwing for a 70% completion percentage, everyone is going to sign you. That's not the case. Here are the full quotes right here. Anderson asked Newton if any team had specifically cited the dreadlocks, especially when he was looking for a new squad after being released from the Patriots in 2021. Newton said, quote, there was hints towards it, and I gained a lot of great counsel from a lot of people. The thing is always mentioned is, yo, Cam, you scaring people the way you look. And I would say, yo, like I'm not going to name names, but there's other quarterbacks that in the league that don't look like me, but they got long hair. I imagine he's talking about people like Justin Herbert, like Trevor Lawrence, white dudes that have long hair. You know that's what he's talking about. Dudes that don't look like me, but got long hair. He's claiming there's some sort of racial motivation. That's what he's talking about with that comment. The fact that Cam Newton, the sad state of his career right now, the way he ended things in uh, New England, you know, came back for Carolina, had a little bit of a one or two game revival there. But in reality, this dude's not cut out for the league anymore. He can't play in this league right now. The fact that he would try to blame it on racism with everything we see what right now, with all the big contracts that black quarterbacks are getting, all the draft, all the black quarterbacks that are getting drafted in the NFL, and you would slide that in there, that is pathetic. That is bitch made. But I mean, that's kind of Cam Newton to a T. Uh, and of course, a lot of people ripped him over this. All you had to do is check out Twitter. Here's a sampling. Didn't have Cam Newton complaining about his job because of his hair on my bingo card this year. Cam Newton's hair is not the reason he isn't signed, LOL. I agree with Cam Newton. My hair and my hair only are also the reason I wasn't given an NFL contract either. And the vast majority of people, if you just search Cam Newton on Twitter right now, are bashing him for this entire take. But, you know, there's some people like the dead spins out there that are saying, it's okay for him to say what's bothering him. I'm sure woke dead spin would side with Cam Newton. But what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments section below. Is this the reason? Is it Cam Newton's dreadlocks that are holding him back from getting an NFL job? Is it because he's black and has black hair? Is that why? Or is it because he kind of just fucking sucks? Let me know in the comments below. Smash a like button, subscribe to the channel, ring the button for notifications, share this video out there, and I'll talk to you later.